how is preparing course curriculum like? Although I am not a professional or expert in the course curriculum preparation, I can sense the tricky parts of preparing the course curriculum. So in today's video, I am going to talk about the four curriculum orientations and their comparisons. I'm also going to talk about a very brief message on the measuring aspects of course curriculum. The four curriculum orientations I had talked about in my previous videos, which you can find the link from above. The first one is technology orientation. What is it? Technology orientation emphasizes upon external variables. Technology orientation also emphasizes on environmental variables affect on humans' behaviors. Second curriculum orientation is the cognitive process. Cognitive process curriculum orientation focuses in helping students acquire specific thinking processes, for example, concepts and problem solving. Third, it would be humanistic orientation. What is it? Humanism curriculum orientation focuses and maximizes students' capacity to develop himself or herself. The last orientation I'm going to talk about is social reconstruction curriculum orientation. Social reconstruction curriculum orientation emphasizes social relations as a goal or an educational means. Why should we know the characteristics of the four curriculum orientations? Because so as to plan the curriculum, we need to be sure which orientation we are about to start for our project. The definitions on the four curriculum orientations I had just mentioned before. So after the decision make on which curriculum orientations, of course, there should be a period for course evaluation, resource re-evaluation, evaluation of implementation events, next, the evaluation of outcomes to serve goals, design, management, and recycle decisions, respectively. Of course, the course curriculum orientations are closely connected with how to measure course or learning curriculum. First, we need measuring tool. So what is the measuring tool? The measuring tool for curriculum or course is assessment. We use assessment tools to test the effectiveness of course learning curriculum. What are the assessment types? Of course, they are written tests, oral examination, portfolios, or perhaps interviews, checklists, etc. We also use assessment types such as heuristic framework, which focuses on higher order processes or lower order processes. Please watch my previous video from the link above on how do you assess course curriculum. Remember, the evaluation of outcomes is very important because the evaluation of outcomes will determine the requirements of the curriculum. The evaluation of outcomes helps the curriculum planner, the source of direction, and accomplishment of the goals and aims of the whole process of curriculum planning. Thank you very much for your participating, watching, and listening. Until next time.